the story of your success begins in your mind. Have you ever thought about that? Let's put it this way. The destiny of who you're meant to be starts in your mind. So all the more reason to transform your mind. doesn't know the difference between or let's say your subconscious doesn't know the difference between truth and a lie so if you got negative chatter from the world from how you feel about yourself someone calling Dave on Skype if you have negative thoughts your subconscious doesn't know the difference Wow so your mind goes to your heart so this is my challenge is write the story on your heart by renewing your mind. Fill your mind with the washing of the word. Best way to erase some negative stuff that happens. Uh, pray in the Holy Spirit. Meditate. Spend time. Think on those things that are worthy, trustworthy, full of virtue, as Paul writes in Philippians chapter 4. You have an incredible destiny. You have a message. The very atmosphere of your message could change someone's life. The very message uh, that you have could be fueled by the Holy Spirit and could propel someone else into their destiny. So what's holding you back? If you're like me, fear hold me back. Perfectionism held me back. Someone needs to hear your word. Someone needs to hear the truth of your destiny, which is greatness. Kingdom thoughts for you. As David harvests corn, <laughs> and I, uh, he's out there in the garden, I'm digging in the water. Two different soils, both reap a harvest. We got some amazing corn. Can I show you? Look at that corn over there. Can you see that? Where the dog is? Harvest thoughts, kingdom thoughts. I hope you'll check us out more of that at facebook.com forward slash Teresa M. Croft. Teresa spelled with an H. God bless you.